Hello children. Today we are going to start with the third term portion. The first lesson in the third term is angles. See John what he used from home he went to post office and from post office he used his way back to home. Now what is this? This you call it is a shape and what is a shape? The shape is make, made up of lines and these lines now what happen? They all meet at one place. They all meet at one place. So this meeting place or meeting point is called as vertex and this vertex is called as an angle. I will repeat once again what is the shape, the shape is making a make made up of lines and these lines they meet at one point or what you call it as the vertex which will make us an angle. See again here this line this is also one of one angle and again this is also one angle, this is also one angle, this is also one angle, the two lines meeting together. And again, this also is an angle. Again, this line meeting together is also called as an angle. So, from home to post office. See, the next one is the activity given in your book. Make your own angle tester. See, cut two strips from a chart paper. Keep one strip over the other and fix a drawing pin in one corner so that both the strips can move around easily. Now angle tester is ready to use. Now what you have to do? Cut two strips from a chart paper. Keep one strip over the other and fix a drawing pin in one corner so that both the strips can move around easily. Now the angle tester is ready to use. See now what happened here is in this angle tester when is it like L when it is in the shape of L. So this is what you call it this is 90 degree. So this what this angle is called as right angle. It is called as right angle. Now angle tester the another shape like V shape. See this you call it as acute angle. You call it as acute angle and this angle is less than 90 degree. This is less than 90 degree. The next in angle tester there is one more angle. Now this is you call it as obtuse angle you call it as the obtuse angle and this angle is more than 90 degree more than 90 degree so there are three angles that is right angle it is just 90 degree, equal to 90 degree the another one is acute angle which is less than 90 degree and the next one is the obtuse angle which is more than 90 degree See, in the activity, make your own angle tester. The first thing what you have to do is keep the two strips as shown like the English alphabet L. Can you see the angle formed between two strips? Now, what is it called as? This is called as right angle. So, the L, English alphabet L is called as right angle. Now, next one is, again what you have to do, fix the two strips like V alphabet V. Here one strip is bent towards the other. Again a different angle is formed which is less than a right angle and this is called acute angle. The next one is keep the two strips as shown in the diagram. Now what can you observe in this? One strip is bent away from the other. Again a different angle is formed which is more than a right angle and this angle is called as obtuse angle. So L alphabet is called as right angle and V which is towards less than a right angle is called acute angle and more than a right angle is called as obtuse angle. Right. 
See the next one is the activity given in your book. By using angle tester, now what you have to do is go around your classroom and look for right angle, right angle, acute angle and the obtuse angle. Now what you have to do is with your angle tester, you have to go around the classroom and find out all these three things, right angle, acute angle and obtuse angle. Now see what is this, the corner of the blackboard, this corner of the blackboard, what, how, which, how shape, what shape is it? It is in the shape of right angle, it is in the shape of right angle. So corner of the blackboard is the right angle. Now for acute angle, now what you can do is the boy wearing the shirt, the bottom of the shirt, see it is like V shape. So this is acute angle, the bottom of the shirt. The bottom of the shirt is in form of or is in the shape of V, what you call it as acute angle. For obtuse angle, the clock in your classroom. So this is the hands of the clock is obtuse angle. So now what is that right angle? This right angle corner of the blackboard is equal to 90 degree. And this bot bottom of the shirt is what you call is less than 90 degree. What is called acute angle. Here the hands of the clock. This hands of the clock is more than 90 degree. This what you call it as the obtuse angle. The rest of the things you can just find out in your classroom. See the next one is the paper folding activity. The first step is take a square sheet of paper. Take a square sheet of paper. The second step is fold it in half. Fold it in half. The third step is you have to fold it once more and press it. Third step is you have to fold it and press it. The fourth step is open the last fold so that the sheet is